Hey everybody, I'm Matt Hill with Night Energy Services. I'm at the NAPE Expo and uh, I'm here as a correspondent for The Crude Life. So I get to highlight uh, people in our industry and their organizations and just tell you a little bit about uh, them and what they do. Uh, Jim, please introduce yourself. So my name is Jim White. I'm the Executive Director for the Society of Exploration Geophysicists. And, w and what do they do? So we're, a, we're basically a society for the geophysicists, uh, basically whether they're students or uh, are career veterans that uh, uh, for the applied geophysics and we, we basically are a, uh, it's an opportunity for them to utilize our uh, our society for networking for uh, continuing education lots of different things that we're doing within the organization that, that that's helping the applied geosciences uh, for those not in oil and gas uh, maybe explain a little bit about what a geophysicist does and uh, what they do for oil and gas. Sure, I mean, it's the geophysicists are, are uh, they're scientists, obviously, go get, get degrees, both uh, bachelor and, and master's, but they, they, uh, they use basically physics and math uh, and ge geology and apply that to basically subsurface imaging. So the idea is to try to image it in the subsurface. Geophysicists interpret data that allow oil companies to, to understand where to drill or where not to drill. A lot of times people are, are, are thinking that every time we do a, a seismic survey that it will immediately find opportunities for people to drill, but we can also eliminate those areas that are not conducive for drilling as well. So, You see anything in our industry that you're excited about, innovation, maybe uh, even for uh, the geophysicist side? Oh, absolutely. Uh, that, that's the thing that's been changing a lot over the last 10, 20 years is the, the, the applied sciences have really come up with some uh, tremendous technology advances that's allowing us to, uh, uh, to enhance our products and enhance our, our, our services with what we're doing uh, you know, for the oil and gas industry. But there's other areas of, of focus that we have for the applied uh, geophysics. Is, you know, carbon solutions is a big thing right now in, in, the, um, uh, in the space. People are trying to get to net zero uh, carbon emissions. And so geophysics is a big part of that uh, as well. Um, uh, geothermal is another where, area where we, uh, we place a lot of effort on the, on the applied geophysics. But one of the good things we're trying to do, and you'll notice with the, uh, uh, in the background, we're, we're actually joining forces with the American Association of Petroleum Geologists. So we're starting to collaborate with other societies to enhance the, uh, the overall effort of what we're trying to achieve for our members and our stakeholders. And, and we're really excited about that and hoping that we can, we can expand on that even further into the uh, uh, engineering side as well. Man, thank you for what you guys do. Uh, I, I always uh, really just thoroughly enjoy meeting new people. So thank you. Um, how do how does everybody get a hold of you? What's uh, what's the website? Are you on LinkedIn? So uh, obviously I'm on LinkedIn, but uh, seg.org is is our website, and uh, our corporate headquarters are now uh, in Houston, which is where where I'm based. But we have a large office and a large contingent of uh, staff in Tulsa, Oklahoma, as well as elsewhere around the world. So. All right. Oh, yeah, I'm from Oklahoma, so there we go. Guys, thank you for uh, tuning in to The Crude Life. Thank you, Jim, for being on. I appreciate it. Take care. God bless everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you.